Hey, welcome everybody. Uh, Charlie with 4BZ Truth. I just wanted to uh, talk to you a little bit about something I'm working on. I didn't want to do a, a live stream today because I got a lot going on and um, I just kind of want to share with you uh, some, like something big that I think is uh, necessary to put a lot of focus into. I'm doing some pre-spring uh, cleanup. And uh, it's actually been kind of a nice January so far. And uh, kind of wanted to share with uh, everybody kind of where I'm at. Okay, so I uh, am kind of a prepper, you might say. Uh, I've been working on uh, cleaning up my garden area. And I uh, kind of wanted to show you a little bit about what I have here. Um, oh my gosh, hold on. Clean off my... See if that's any better. Yep. So this is a uh, my. Um, I have a tree growing right here. I don't even know if it's going to be um, kept because it, it might not be the tree that I was told it was. <laughs> I was told it's a cherry tree, but it actually, uh, I don't know if it was producing cherries. Well, it hasn't produced cherries since I've owned it. So, anyways, but that's a grapevine. There's three different. Well, there's two varieties but there's two different vines of the Concord grapes. And then the other is green, green grapes. I don't even know what they're called, but, um, and then there's my, my little helper. Um, this right here is a, a, a box that has, uh, some, uh, asparagus. You can kind of see where they were cut off there. Um, let's see if I can, yeah, there's some right there. There's, they kind of grow in little patches cause they're all, uh, basically just part of a root system. Um, and then we have now again, these boxes need to be, uh, redone because they're falling apart. But, uh, this is, a a box. You got some boxes back here. Um, I'm probably going to redo the, the in-between spaces because they're full of soil and chicken poop because a lot of the chickens were, well, all of the chickens have been running through here. Um, here's another box. I had uh, cucumbers in this one, uh, which were uh, pickling cucumbers. You can see kind of a, a leftover cucumber there. Um, but again, anytime you have uh, vegetables that are rotting in there. It actually helps fertilize the soil. Um, this is uh, my uh, herb. or it, Basically, it's my rosemary, sage, thyme, and uh, oregano. They keep coming back every year. Um, unless we have a, a harsh winter and then they die. Um, but I'm cleaning up all the weeds and stuff. Um, it kind of got messy uh, since I've been working on it. Then I have my little dryer drums that uh, I use as planters. Um, and then, of course, my chicken coop. Um, this uh, tree here is an apple tree. Uh, it's a, um, a honey crisp apple tree. And, uh, again, this is something I built with, uh, with my own hands. And uh, I'm actually going to tear this uh, run extension down. Hey, Theo, stop touching that, bud. I don't know if you can see in here. Um, this is the run extension. And I actually, the wind tore off the, the tarp. So, and then I have an aprium tree, which is a apricot plum. And... Uh, yeah, so I just kind of wanted to show everybody what I have going on, starting to, you know, clear out the garden, getting it ready. I'm going to have a huge garden this year, but you can kind of see the direction I'm going with it. So, and the chickens are trying to tell me to come in there and play with them. <laughs> They're actually very friendly little creatures, and it's very enjoyable to have them. But anyways, all right, guys, thanks for watching and we'll talk to you soon. All right, bye.